need, so this is like the next level. So the coarse grit stone is good for the first time you sharpen. The medium grit is your working area where you can still maintain and fix chips. You can still use the 1K on that, mm -hmm. or 1500, 2000 or something. Uh, and then in that range, it's still usable edge, but also you can do some work on it. Once you hit the 5000 range and higher, that you have to have the work done earlier. Okay, okay. So this is the first stone that gets you to the polished edge. And this is the game changer for scraping. Uh, we saw in chapter four, how that, that, you know, the big saw teeth, and then you oh, get yeah, that final yeah. one. So this is where you're starting getting into that smooth, you know, freshly paved road scrape, all right, before they dig it up. So, okay, so we're gonna start with the dime again. Again, this is just maintenance. You see how quiet this one is? Yeah, yeah. yeah it is. <laughs> it's stealth. <laughs> River rock. <laughs> <laughs> no better than a river rock. <laughs> but this is, again, this is where you start getting your mirror finish, your polish. Whereas on some of the other stones, you'd have to sit there for 20 minutes and then work up a paste and, and finally get it to be shiny, uh, like on the Kings, like on yours. Uh, then they'll do that. So this will be shiny, hopefully, as soon as I get out there. So you can see the glimmer. Oh yeah, you can Already see we're getting, yeah. right? Now I'm not worried about how beautiful the mirror is at this point. Mm -hmm. But that's again behind there. And we didn't really remove that, but we're still removing steel. The black stuff coming off here is much thinner, All right? So we've basically made behind the bevel shiny. Okay. Yeah, All right, it's yeah. as it dries, it becomes more mirror-like. Mm -hmm. yeah. See the end of this? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. So it's pretty too, and it, it's really sharp at that point. So now, but we haven't hit the edge yet. So now we use the, the nickel to come in and get that reinforced angle and the actual edge. And here the sound difference. Now you're actually getting something. So before, nothing. Mm -hmm. Today, now you can hear right. this a little bit. Though. This is an indicator as well. Don't chase that because you're gonna go higher and higher each time. You're, you're gonna lose that sound once you, you're there it, it kind of settles down again. It doesn't become quieter, but it, it, if you push it further and past that, then you begin to roll your edge. This is where it becomes dangerous that you got to keep that same angle. Because um, this stone will roll the edge over and then it won't be dull. But it won't fix it. <laughs> oh, <bummer. laughs> I get to know. Danger will run. <laughs> all right. So I'm just coming back, making sure it's all pretty for the camera. Now here, you're not going to really be able to tell the burr, but it's there. It's, this is where a lot of people are like, it's not sharp anymore. You're not used to it being this tiny. It's really, really compact and dense. All right, so um, so then we're going to finish with the, the dime towards us. Again, that offset angle. Okay. It's interesting. I can feel the steel, like how relatively soft it actually is on this. Mm. It's, it's again, it's kind of like that Ando steel is kind of being, it just digs into the steel, it makes it grippy, but it still sharpens it. So for this knife, this may not be the best level because it's in, it becomes too weak to hold it. It has no structure. So this is where the steel comes into play okay. of how, how, how refined you should get. Uh, this is where the steel quality plays into okay. that, which you have no control of except of which knife you buy. Uh, but then you have to know this will take it. Right. Agendas will take it. Um, you know, the lower level knives generally know. So, okay, so we've got the burr here. So we're gonna come back with the nickel. As I think we all agree that single-sided strokes do make it better mm -hmm. in the end. So I'm gonna wipe that off. The dime. The nickel. Amen. Right, I'm finish with away from you with the nickel. All right. So you can feel again that here there's actually like quote unquote no burr, but it's it's really just so fine that you're not acclimated to that yet. So we're going to finish 
Uh, actually, let's pass the edge tester around first. Finish. So 12 o'clock on the right side, it clicks in, and you see how quiet this is? Mm -hmm. And then default, one o'clock, that's it.